The 2023 Journal Citation Reports is here, and we've made some changes to help you make more confident decisions based on trusted journal data. Journals in the Arts and Humanities Citation Index and the Emerging Sources Citation Index will receive journal impact factors for the very first time this year. This means that now, journals in all editions of the Web of Science core collection will have a journal impact factor ensuring more complete journal profiles across all areas of research. This is the latest in a series of improvements designed to pave the way for more responsible research assessment. In 2021, Clarivate first introduced Arts and Humanities and Emerging Sources Citation Index journals into the JCR, while also introducing a new Normalized Journal Citation Indicator value. Each AHCI and ESCI journal received a journal citation indicator value and additional descriptive metrics. In this 2023 release, these journals will now also have a journal impact factor. And in next year's 2024 release, these journals will be fully included in subject category rankings and GIF quartiles. Let's take a look at where you'll find this data. Search for a journal name, then open its profile page. The journal impact factor is the first metric available in the journal performance section. Click to view the complete calculation. Additional data places the GIF into context, including the trend graph and contributing items from the GIF's numerator and denominator. Scroll down to also see the citation distribution details which include both an article and review document citation median. And explore beyond the GIF with the journal citation indicator and more. If you're new to the journal impact factor or journal citation indicator, click here to watch a short video that explains each one. AHCI and ESCI journals will not display rank data or journal impact factor this year but that will be available in next year's 2024 JCR release. We are taking a phased approach to provide transparency on the impact to GIF rankings and quartiles. Another significant update in the 2023 JCR is a change to the display of GIFs across all subject categories. JCR will now display the GIF to one decimal place, rather than three decimal places as it has been in past years. The use of one decimal place means it's more likely that ties will occur in subject category rankings. In the event of ties, you're encouraged to use additional metrics from a journal's profile, like the normalized journal citation indicator, to better understand a journal's overall performance. If you would like to learn more about how ties affect rankings and quartiles in the JCR, read our detailed article on this topic. Make better informed, more confident decisions with publisher-neutral journal intelligence.